Cincinnati City Council approved a new parking plan for over the Rhine around Finley Market. It will reconfigure more than 800 spaces with the goal of balancing parking for residents, customers and employees who are all vying for parking spots in that area. Thanks for joining us at six. I'm Rob Williams. Trisha is off tonight. Mike Shale has more on how the plan divides the available parking spaces. A lot of new businesses and an increase in population here in North Over the Rhine are causing a parking problem. Businesses say they need spots for their customers. The residents say they need a place to park in front of their homes. The city's plan, which encompasses more than 800 parking slots, will be reconfigured to include parking for residents only, paid parking, and flex parking, which is shared between the residents and the business customers depending on the time of day. I think it's probably the best we could get, but it's it, it, the whole process has been incredibly hard. Alexis Marsh says she is leading the charge on behalf of the residents of North Over the Rhine. All of our city councilors are so pro-development with the blind spots on of like, all that matters is building housing, building apartments without providing the needed parking, and that's creating this mess. In August, Marsh gave a first-hand look at where she says the problems are. Under this new plan, this is the plan here, it's going to be turned into flex parking. Hey, just uh, documenting how many empty spots there are in the garage. Level B, A and B, pretty full. On September 1st, Marsh posted this video on social media showing the empty parking spots in the Finley Market garage. It is one of two garages that the county owns and is not part of the compromise. But the city says they are talking with county commissioners to help reduce the cost of garage parking for residents and employees. That's an ongoing discussion to have employee parking, like so maybe they get a discount. So the county obviously will need to determine that since they own the garage. That is one potential solution in the future, especially north of Finley. As more residents grow. Council member Mark Jeffrey says he is also in negotiations with Metro and the operators of the streetcar to see if public transportation might be able to relieve some of the pressure. You feel good about this proposal? I do. I think it's the right compromise. Look, democracy is compromise. I think each side kind of gave a little bit and uh, and I think it's a solid proposal going forward. Going forward means getting new signs printed up and getting them to the parking spots. The compromise also calls for a revaluation of the plan in six months. That's when all sides will come together and suggest any changes that could be made to the plan. In North Over the Rhine, Mike Shell, Fox 19 Now.